The date was November 5th, 1913, the official opening of the LA Aqueduct. Mulholland was there, and he spoke his now famous words, There it is, take it. Newly built LA Aqueduct transported water from the Owens Valley 233 miles south to Los Angeles area. The Van Norman Dams, also known as the San Fernando Dams, were located at the end of the Los Angeles Aqueduct, also called the Terminus. Here's what the reservoir looked like prior to 1970, and here's what they look like today. 1971, the Silmar San Fernando earthquake significantly damaged the dams. 1971, not far away, another crisis. Van Norman Dam, the huge reservoir in the northern hills. The concrete roadway across the tops collapsed. 11 million tons of water. Enough to start another Johnstown flood. And 80,000 people living in the valley just below. At the time, the water in the reservoir supplied about 80% of the water for Los Angeles County. Here's how it looks today. You can see the dam, and they can also see how the reservoir is empty. The earthquake significantly damaged the dams. It was estimated that a dam failure could have killed at least 123,000 people at the time. 80,000 people had to be evacuated for a total of three days. Luckily, at the time of the earthquake, the water height of the lower dam was about half capacity. Reconstruction of the dams was proposed, but it was abandoned after the foundations were shown to be inherently unstable. As a replacement, the Los Angeles Dam was constructed between the original Lower and Upper Van Norman Dam structures in a more stable location. I sure hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.